So I have this kind of NVMe, pulled out from my Dell Optiplex 3080 Micro, a 256GB worth of storage, PCIe Gen 3x4, M key slot. I will be transferring this into my main machine, which is the ThinkPad T480 laptop. As I did my research, this kind of NVMe won't fit on the WLAN slot of the ThinkPad. I gone through some forums to confirm this. I found an adapter to convert this PCIe NVMe into the SATA bus slot of the ThinkPad. It has B and M keyed slot into the adapter. I bought it from this link, scan the QR code to check the product page of it. This will perfectly fit into the NVMe with M keyed slot into the adapter. Now here is the NVMe SSD and the adapter itself. It has two extra screw and a screwdriver upon purchase. You will just need to slide in the NVMe into the adapter. It will be similar to this after you successfully insert the NVMe into the adapter. Now let's power on the laptop and go into the BIOS settings. We will just need to disable the built-in battery before we open the bottom cover of the ThinkPad. Press the Enter key several times upon booting, then press F1 on the next screen. Using the arrow keys on your keyboard, press the right arrow to go into the config settings, then power while pressing the Enter key on the keyboard. Go to the Disable built-in battery and press Enter. This will now shut down the laptop. Remove the external battery and we will proceed to open it. Using your screwdriver, loosen all the screw and carefully pry the bottom cover until you manage to lift the entire bottom cover. Grab the NVMe adapter and insert it into the WLAN slot of the laptop. You will need a screw to lock M up into place. You can use the screw provided on your purchase. Secure the screw into place. If you have a thermal pad lying around, you can also put it at the back of the NVMe. Put the back cover into place and secure the screws. You will need to connect the power brick into the laptop so that you will be able to power it on again. Once connected on the power supply, turn it on. I'm using Zorin OS for this laptop. Let's boot into the desktop. I will open up the disk utility on Linux. From here the CL13D to 56Q11 NVMe is detected successfully. The second drive I have on this machine is the Kingstone SSD. I must say that the adapter that I bought is compatible on this ThinkPad. There is no other additional settings has to be made on the BIOS. That's about it for this video. Thanks for watching.